Hello everybody and welcome to my channel Sincerely Jacqueline DIY. Today I'm going to be doing something a bit different than I usually do. I am going to be doing my first fashion DIY. I absolutely love fashion and I love styling items and making them my own. But sometimes when you have a vision of something and you can't find it, the perfect thing is if you can DIY it. So I had this beautiful straw raffia bag that I got from Spain three years ago and I loved how simple it was and that I could add accessories and do things to it to kind of spruce it up but I really wanted to do something really different this year. I saw a tutorial about these raffia flowers and I thought I could replicate it and spice up my bag. So what you're gonna need for this DIY is some raffia ribbon and these large faux pearls and what we're going to be doing is making some raffia pom-poms. So what I did was take a square uh, cardboard and cut it to the size that I want my pom-pom or flower to be. And I wrapped the raffia ribbon about 30 times around my cardboard. Then you want to carefully remove the raffia from the cardboard. Next, to make the flower, I am cutting the top and bottom half of the raffia that I made after I tied them together. And then you want to fold it down to make a little flower. And as you can see, it is making a flower silhouette. And what I did is I added the pearl bead onto my flower just by stringing it onto my string and then tying it to the back so you don't see the string from the front. Next, you want to clean up your flower by cutting it to size and trimming it. And there you have it, a really pretty raffia flower with a pearl center. Now for this project, I needed five of them, so I went ahead and made five of them. So to attach it to my bag, you will need an embroidery needle. And what an embroidery needle is, is a needle much bigger than a regular needle. And that is to be able to put it through the straw. Now once uh, putting the embroidery needle through, what I did is I fed it back out 
to the front of the bag and then I tied a knot behind the flower. And you wanna repeat that to attach all your raffia flowers. And here is the final product. I really, really love how it came out. And I love how it turned this really plain bag into something really, really unique and pretty. Now, you don't have to just make a bag with this. You can use these raffia flowers to attach to many different items just to create something new. I can so see myself attaching it to a pair of sandals or attaching it to other things. And I absolutely love how it came out and how expensive it looked. And the funny thing was it only cost a couple dollars to make. Thank you guys for watching my video. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Also comment below if you liked or enjoyed this fashion DIY and if you want to see more fashion DIYs. Lastly, please subscribe guys and be sure to visit me on Instagram at Sincerely Jacqueline or on my blog at www.sincerelyjacqueline.com. I'm so excited to be back and making videos and I'm excited to start making more fashion DIYs. So if you like fashion DIYs, please guys give me a thumbs up and I'll be back next week making more home decor DIYs as well. Thank you guys for joining me. Bye.